Well, good morning, everybody, ladies and gentlemen, and all ships at sea. This is Mr. Tiny Retirement. Okay, here comes the fun part. Okay, here we go. All finished. Explain. Like I was trying to explain. I did go with the cardboard, get a better look at the ends. And of course, the uh, bungees or rope on the one inch screws or however you decide to fashion it down. Now there's no cold air blowing through there and a starter tray starts. Now this is totally portable. You can use it on the rows or with starter trays like that, because I think I heard once that starter trays and the seedlings do better facing the rows going north and south instead of east and west. I don't know why. If you know why, please leave a comment because I cannot remember because I'm getting old. <laughs> and, uh, and I br brought Mrs. Tiny out here, give you a better look at the seedling tray in there. I bet you I could fit three maybe four in there oh i bet four easily four easily yeah and let's let's get an opinion oh you're gonna you're, film me <laughs> no nah, i'm not gonna i won't film you no i'll get in there all right. it's all right i'll get all right. I've been in the garage we're still yeah, trying we've to been. unpack we're coming up on oh, two what? years and we're still unpacking yeah. the garage all right gerard is in jail by the way everybody that's <laughs> yeah, right there you go this is gonna work so awesome. all you have to do is unhook the well, yeah, so you can take those, slide those in and out if it's, you know, yeah. you want them to have air or put them or down through the night. It's like a mini greenhouse. Yeah, exactly. This is awesome. And where like, it's. Can you make me four or five more of these? I'm going to make, I have pallets to make three more. Okay. I'll, I'll make do. more. Okay, quick review. The pallets you saw earlier, I tore apart, I tried different ways. If you own a Sawzall with the wood with nail blade, that works really well. And the only thing I bought was the polycarb, two 12-footers, cut in half to six foot because they were 32, 33 bucks for each 12-footer, or you can spend $22 for an eight-footer. So we went with six just for the cheapo factor and on top of that it seems that these six footers will be easier to handle when you're picking them up and moving them and would fit into an eight foot raised bed a little bit easier too if you're going to use them for direct sew which we probably will try i'm sure we'll try and there we go four out of four pallets had plenty of wood left over and then the cross board, so that will be some good kindling for the wood stove. 
Mrs. Tiny has already begun. Can't see because the sun's so bright now. And she chose to leave the ends open for right now. And I'm sure one of us will put the uh, cardboard back up like the, this one for tonight. Also, I'd like to mention that I kind of put the dirt up around the edges a little bit, just so nothing would leak through. Kind of dirt caulked them. So when we close them up like that, they are going to be airtight and no cold can get in and the warm cannot get out. Now,